be best off, mate. Hey, everybody, it's that sideways rain that gets you wet. Oh, it's that horrid sideways rain. I want you all. I'm hiding. I'm hiding out here. You're doing amazing. Keep smiling. You know what Manchester's like. It's always wet, but we absolutely love it. Now, the players are on the way. And you know what? This is true Manchester. So what better way for them to get to us all than getting on the tram? As you can see, they are already getting the party started. Having a load of fun as they make their way to the beginning of the open top, where we hope it's going to be an open top bus parade. They look like they're having plenty of fun, them boys. They've got a Jack Grealish likes a beer, we know that now. Jack Grealish hasn't stopped drinking since Saturday night, let's face it. Has he still got his top on? He might still have his full kit on, to be honest, from that he played in. Right, we're going to keep the music going. You lot keep partying in that rain. We know there's nothing going to dampen your spirits. We'll be back with you very, very shortly. Come on, City! As you can see up there right now, what about celebrations, Natalie, as well? Unbelievable at weekend, Oh, hold on, there's Pep, apparently. Is it's that Pep, Pep on? on? It is, that's Pep on the bus. I love it, they're taking selfies on the bus. That's incredible. So the bus is like in Market Street now, so you've got an idea of where they are. They're at Marks and Spencer's. That's a nice plug for them, isn't it? They're going past there now. Look at so the... So you'll see the players in there uh, having a few scoops, getting excited, getting ready to join us down here. We're going to get wet, but you're not bothered, are you, Tom? No, no. I mean, this is what it's all about. I mean, I mean I've got a fringe, but the fringe can, the fringe can get wet. <laughs> Natalie's gone off to go and get the brolly, but we're going to have to stick it out out here. So listen, you look at this season, I mean, you went into the season as Premier League champions. We've now won three on the spin. We've now won the FA Cup this season, the Champions League this season. As an eight-year-old Joe from back in the day, did you ever think you'd see these days? <laughs> There's Joe. your that. I want to be there. <laughs> We can sort that out for you, mate, don't <laughs> no, worry. <yeah>. Uh, <laughs> joking, nah, it's class. Yeah, nah, you, you can't... You, you, I just don't... It's just mad, innit? It? it is. We were talking all the time, we always bump into each other. It's just mental, innit? Like, you, you're sort of pinching yourself. It's like, just unreal. Like, I, I'm absolutely buzzing. I can't tell you it's enough. I'm, like, I'm sure everyone here is, like... It's just mental, innit? I guess I'm when you... Um, That's weird. When you're a rock star, I guess you get into some decent parties some decent VIP events. I saw you at the one at the FA Cup, don't lie. Do you get to hang out with the players? Who's your favourite? Who's the nicest? I love uh, I love Johnny Stones. John Stones. Johnny, Johnny Stones. Johnny Stones. Come on! Johnny Stones. <laughs> Do I? Legend. Look at this. You can, get a, you can get your normal crowd singing Charlemagne, but you can get this lot singing Johnny Stones. I do not the players are on the way. Pep is on the way. The rain is not stopping you, and it is not stopping Pep Guardiola.
this is my city. And I can't believe this. I can't believe that I'm standing here and City have done this. And I'm standing here as a City fan because I know there's a lot of City fans out there that got a lot of grief for a long time. And I was there, I was one of those people. And now it's our time and it feels good. That time. It definitely does feel good. I mean, did you ever think almost 24 years ago, Dicky, to the day you scored that goal that got City out of the third tier into the second tier? Did you ever think you'd see a day like this? You thinking, you know, was it even something you dreamt about? Because the same year United did it, they did the treble, we got promoted into the second division. Did you ever think there'd be a day you saw this? No, I don't think it would have got taken away in a straight jacket if you'd said back then. <laughs> um, but look, I know they've done the treble, we've done it properly because we beat them in the FA Cup final. Dead well. right! Yeah! <laughs> right, rate me, this is a tough question, rate me, Dickoff's goal in 99, Aguero's goal in 2012 and Rodri's goal in 23. Are you having a laugh? That's like, I've got three kids. <laughs> goals this season, his first season in the, in the Premier League and he's won a Daddy's treble. Daddy's got his top off! Oh, there he is, he's... <laughs> Look at him, the big Nordic meat shield. He's giving it out on the top of that bus. But just a, just a, just a word on early and, and the impact that he's made at Manchester City. He's like, he's, he's not just sensational, he's been called a freak, he's been called robotic. He's, for somebody who's only 22 years old, to come in and have the impact at the club he's had. And don't forget, people were saying that he joined the wrong club. Come on. <laughs> Can we go? Yeah, he, he couldn't adapt to our style. Shove the 52 goals up your backside. And yes, Dickie! Yes! <laughs> right, we've been asking everybody, what's your favourite city song? We're going to get the crowd going, we're keeping everybody nice and warm. Mike, favourite song? We're going to get you conductor. Favourite city favorite song? Favourite city song? It's got to be... It's Let's get ready to make some noise. As first, we are going to welcome onto stage some very wet, but some very happy. Let's make some noise for the backroom staff. Here we go. Manchester City, put your heads together for the hard-working staff behind the scenes of Manchester City. Careful though, keep that there, keep going. If you guys can make your way to the back. These are all the people that have worked so, so hard throughout the season and contributed massively to what this club have done. We've got a lot of people to get on a very wet stage, so if you guys can all move a bit back. Okay, next up. Let's make some noise for the management team and the manager, Pep Guardiola! <laughs> Just before we welcome the players onto stage, let's have a word with the man himself, Pep. Not much, don't you worry, it won't be much, but I just want to say, by your own admission, you needed to win the Champions League uh, to be deemed a success at Manchester City. You've won it, you are a complete success. How does it feel? What a parade, what, what an afternoon. So, we had to be the best parade with this rain, otherwise it's not Manchester. This is Manchester, this is how it rolls. It has to be like that. No sunshine, no, we don't want sunshine. We want rain, rain. So, the perfect one. Pep, hundreds of thousands of blues 
stayed, they sang, they didn't care about the rain. All they wanted was to see you and your players and your staff. We have the best fans in the world, right? But they are used to, so they are used to so to the rain. Yeah, there's a... Away, a certain Mr. Noel Gallagher. Sadly, he cannot be here with us as he's on tour in America. I don't know about you, I don't know about you all, but I think it's about time Oasis got back together. What do you think? Uh, he, miss, he missed the opportunity. I don't know what he's doing in America or in Canada or wherever. He should be here. Come on. You want to see Oasis? He will be back. Yes. <laughs> right, right, okay. We are going to welcome onto the stage, led by the striking Viking, the Manchester City players! Let's have a look. Oh, right, let's get chat, these trophies on the stage. John, how's the party? Oh, he's gone. That's how good the party was. John, how good was the party? How good is it? Johnny, Johnny Scott. Johnny. Johnny, Johnny Scott. Johnny, Johnny Scott. He gets the blues excited. He fucking hates United! Johnny! Johnny Stones! Johnny! Johnny Stones! Champion! It's champion! It's ole, ole, ole! Champion! It's champion! It's ole, ole, ole! Champion! It's champion! It's ole, ole, ole. <laughs> wow, everyone's having a good time. We're just waiting for the trophies to arrive. Yeah, there's Hopefully just... led in by a few of our amazing players. There's just three special things that are missing now. Oh, hold on, Calvin wants to do another song. Should we let Calvin sing? We can have a song, can't we? So, where is he? Where's the pigeon? Pigeon needs feeding, where is he? Where's the pigeon? We've got to go, we've got to go, we've got to go. The pigeon needs feeding! <laughs> He's got his high fist up, make some noise for Jack Freelis! And please welcome, with the Premier League trophy, Kevin De Bruyne! Welcome with the FA Cup trophy, Kyle Walker! And welcome with the Champions League trophy, Ilkay Gundogan! Thank you very much. Thanks for all the support during the whole season. 
It's been incredible, and we got to be trophy! Guys, guys, seriously. You all right, Jack? Your throat is gone. Huh? You all right? Yeah, just basically, for the past 24 hours, I've had the best day and night, to be fair. I don't think I've slept. Right, I'm a turkey, and the turkey needs feeding. Jack, 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 is the pigeon thirsty? Or is it the turkey? Right, OK, let's get ready to make some noise for the treble winners, Manchester City! Right, okay everybody, we are really sorry about the weather but we know it's Manchester and it can happen. I hope you've all had an amazing time here at the treble parade. Thank you so much for joining us. One more time, give it up for the treble winners, Manchester City!